Hello, I'm Emily Spaven. This is your Week in Tech. In investment news, health tech startup Carer raised £1.3 million from investors including David Buttress, the CEO of Just Eat. Carer seeks to match patients with carers, providing over 65s with care in their own homes. Push4, a content sharing platform, raised £1.2 million from investors including NT Asset and C12 Ventures. The firm hopes to use the funds to take its business global. Scotland-based travel tech firm Skyscanner has been bought by China's Ctrip.com in a £1.4 billion deal. Skyscanner was valued at $1.6 billion in a funding round back in January. UK-based VC Seraphim Capital announced the launch of an early-stage space tech venture fund. It's already secured £50 million to invest in tech with potential space applications, including AI and robotics. Philip Hammond delivered the autumn statement, revealing an extra £2 billion will be put into R&D per year by 2021. Hammond said this was to ensure the next generation of discoveries is made, developed and produced in Britain. Overseas, the South Korean authorities raided Samsung's offices. They're allegedly investigating whether South Korea's president pressured the National Pension Fund to support a Samsung merger in exchange for financial favours. Our download of the week is BrickShots. With the app, you can convert your photographs into buildable LEGO models. Upload a photo, pick your colour scheme, and the app will tell you which bricks to put where in order to recreate your image in LEGO. And finally, we all know how difficult it is to navigate the pavements while texting, but the National University of Singapore thinks it has the solution. It's created self-driving scooters, which have sensors to help people avoid bumping into things as they go up at their handsets. That's all for this week's episode. For more technology news, visit techcitynews.com and follow us on Twitter.